bruschetta. We're going to use the organic poultry mix. I'm using organic fresh rosemary, baby dill, sage, a little bit of mint, just a little. Full day seasoning, a little pesto with quinoa, soy cream, and of the age of spinach, and one dozen eggs. Let's get We're going to talk to a woman who lost 75 pounds just by eating healthy. Uh, we're going to talk to her and then we'll come back and make our cake. You lost a lot of weight. How did you lose it? I started in January of 2013. I was up late one night and I saw an infomercial. And it was the Nutribullet. Mm. The Nutribullet is a product where you can order the machine. Actually, they make it easy for you. You make the, the first down payment, and you break up the payments for you. It's very inexpensive, and then when your machine arrives along with a cookbook and a nutritional book, it helps you to develop Nutribullet drinks each morning, and it gradually much better, it's healthy with diabetes and other health conditions. How much so weight did you lose? highly recommend it. I've lost uh, approximately 75 pounds. Oh my goodness. And no other supplements, just... No, I still take my vitamins. Okay. You know, I mean, as a woman, I believe a woman should have vitamin D, uh, multivitamin each day. But overall, um, just changing your diet slightly. Boiling your meat, baking your meat, you know, increasing your vegetables. Usually in my Nutribullet I put spinach, banana, orange, apple. I put uh, summer squash. Uh, I get uh, flaxseed because I have joint problems. And you can get that at Winco. They get them, they have them in the bin. So you can go and get a pound, whatever you need. And the books will direct you to certain nuts like almonds and walnuts and each nut has its own properties in terms of healing mm -hmm. and helping you with various conditions. They don't guarantee that you're going to uh, get rid of your diabetes, but certainly my levels have gone down to the normal range. So I would highly recommend that to at least look into it because they have infomercials on all the time. So awesome. I'm very happy with that product and happy with my weight loss and my overall health is improved greatly. And the exercise, you're doing water aerobics. Yes, and water aerobics, especially for women with joint problems. Um, you know, getting a membership at a gym is well worth it because it is fun. You find a lot of women of various ages, particularly women who are older and who have, you know, had children and we put on the weight and it's hard to get it off. And, but just think, if you could increase your energy and get into some kind of weekly exercise, maybe a good three days a week would be fine, as long as you tweak your diet so that your diet serves to help you to get healthier. And that's, I mean, that's great advice for minority women. Just do not get complacent. We all, I'm guilty myself. We yeah. can be, you know, guilty of getting complacent. Well, when my mom was alive, she made a lot of soul food. Oh, but, you we know, all love it. Yeah, but she <laughs> had, a, you know, a lot of health problems at the end of her life. So, you know, I, I've seen, um, you know, the, the signs along the way that show me that I need to do something better so that I can maintain my health. So how do you still enjoy the soul food. Did you change anything? Oh, only occasionally I eat it. I, because certain things like a lot of greens and you know, beans and rice and things, are, some things are seasonal. Like around the holidays you can enjoy what you want to eat. Mm -hmm. uh, my biggest challenge is staying away from a lot of concentrated sweets, like pies and cakes, cookies, 
So, I mean, that's my challenge because I still have those cravings, but that's just all part of, you know, we grew up with a lot of sweets. And so that's, that's a habit that I'm trying to, to break or minimize. So, I mean, the Nutribullet hasn't taken away all of the challenges that I have, but it certainly has given me a tool to help me manage better. Thank you. You're welcome. We're going to make a very nice salad that's almost a meal uh, with beautiful spinach, baby greens, a little dill, a little ginger, and a wonderful dressing to eat a little bit of garlic bread, and this will fill you up and keep you full till dinner time. So we have our lettuce, our spinach. Before we finish our salad, Let's take a look at a film by Sony. It's called Irrational Man, and it's in theaters uh, July 17th, and it's directed by Woody Allen. I don't understand. You've been in such a touchy mood. I'm fine. I just want to go to the concert. Yeah, but the only reason I got the tickets is because you said you wanted to go. Well, I'm sorry, Roy. I just had a change of heart. Go with a friend. Yeah, I will, but I was looking forward to going with you. Well, I just, I'm not up to it, all right? I, I think you're losing interest in me because of Abe Lucas. Oh, God, Roy. We've had this conversation so many times. He's a friend. I think you'd be fine if he was more than a friend. Well, can we please not discuss but Jill, this? Jill, it's so obvious. It's obvious. You know what? There's nothing going on, so you're paranoid. OK. OK. Well, I'll just go to the concert with Mike. We all have fun. Mike is sweet. Fourth of July. Oh, well, this is yeah. You're right, right? It's a good yeah. You strawberry. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's pretty. You might as well take it in. Randy 